Let's get it, guys. New contract, mega pack, massive amounts of energy. Shout out to Hailey. Hailey. Anyways, fair use. She's getting into the contract and the details, and we're going to talk about it. And she has a great channel, so go over there, like, share, subscribe. As you can see, I'm already subscribed. And hit that like button on each of her videos. Show love. All right, here we go. Tesla provides power with 15.3 gigawatts an hour of omega packs for solar plus storage projects let's get it Tesla Energy have been given a massive new contract and it really seems like these energy contracts are now coming in thick and fast. Just like the previous deals that we've heard about, this one also involves mega packs and is with a company called Intersect Power. Inter now remember that before she dives into this, this is a little bit, uh, you know, video was from the past, but this is one of the videos I watched along with other videos and doing due diligence and research. I'm also looking at different types of books. There's a guy called Siba. He provides good information about just energy period so you can understand the industry a little bit better but net net at the end of the day these are some of the contracts that i've like found out about and did research prior to latest quarter on the earnings when you've seen wow energy is really picking up for the second third quarter in a row it's like yeah duh right these contracts and understanding the industry if you just did a little research you would have found that out and been able to understand that and place those chips, those investments into that specific company, knowing that their future was bright when it came down to energy storage. Let's continue. Tech Power are a US-based clean energy company that focus on developing and operating <coughs> large-scale renewable energy projects. This new contract that they have with Tesla is huge. It's to supply a battery energy storage system using 15.3 gigawatt hours of mega packs. And just to give you some context about how big this really is, one gigawatt hour is a lot of energy. This contract is for 15.3, but even so, one gigawatt hour is enough to power approximately 876,000 households for one year if they collectively consume 10,000 kilowatt hours each. And this assumes also that the plant is continuously working throughout the year. The scale of this contract is extremely large. Just to give you even more context here, in Q1 2024, Tesla deployed 4.1 gigawatt hours. In Q2, they deployed 9.4 gigawatt hours of energy storage products, which is their highest quarterly deployment to date. So 9.4 is the highest they've ever deployed. This contract is for 15.3. Tesla are aiming to deploy nearly 10 gigawatt hours of large scale energy storage at the site by the end of 2027. And the full storage capacity of 15.3 gigawatt hours is expected to be supplied by 2030. And approximately this deal is estimated to be worth about $3 billion. Sheldon Kimber, who is the CEO of Intersect Power said this, no one in the market can match Tesla's depth of experience in storage technology. This partnership is the foundation of one of the largest and fastest growing storage portfolios in the country here at Intersect Power. This storage franchise is the perfect complement to our multi-billion dollar expansion of renewable generation that is expected to more than triple the size of our company over the next three years. Now look at that guys. No one is able to match Tesla in this. Man, the conversation is always around these goddamn vehicles and people just ignore these batteries. No one in the market can match Tesla's depth of experience in storage technology. No one in the market. So unlike when we talked about NVIDIA and there was other matches in the market and competitors like AMD and Intel, et cetera, I mean, it's the same type of position and privilege that actually Tesla has that people say NVIDIA have in the IP intellectual property, that experience, and it's fundamental. And for this multi-billion dollar expansion of renewable generation, come on, man, triple in size of the company over the next three years. So that's a happy client and a happy customer that actually will translate in the profits for them. So this is good. Is. So if a company is looking to increase their energy storage capacity, they are going to go to Tesla. It is evident by this statement here and all the other ones that we're seeing come out, all the other deals that we're seeing. And we're seeing so much momentum build within Tesla's energy segment. I'm really excited to see the numbers for energy in the upcoming Tesla earnings, and then obviously the earnings uh, in the future as well. So why are Tesla mega packs so important? Why are they in high demand? And why are they causing Tesla energy to see so much? And that actually ended up happening. Later on, after this video, it came and showed on the financials. Much growth. Well, Tesla mega packs are large scale utility grade energy storage systems, and they're designed to store and manage renewable energy for large scale applications.
applications. And that last bit is really important, large scale applications, because Tesla do offer power walls and power packs for smaller um, applications. But the mega packs are really when enterprises, when organizations are looking to store and manage large amounts of energy. Mega packs help stabilize the grid by storing excess energy that is generated from renewable sources, so solar and wind. And then those mega packs are able to release that energy um, during peak demand times. And this, of course, reduces the need for fossil fuel based energy sources. So why are they in demand? Well, we already know that many and even if it doesn't reduce because people are going to get mad about that. Why we want to reduce? Why can't we do this? Why can't we do that? Look, it's still an effective and efficient technology, regardless if you're using that, you still need to store the energy. So just relax. OK, generation is one conversation, but storage is a completely new aspect and it doesn't have to translate and correlate to the generation countries and many companies within those countries are having a massive, massive push towards being more sustainable using renewable energy and reducing their carbon footprint. In fact, many countries actually have um, missions to do this. Many companies have manifestos, you know, it's very important at the moment. And you have to be able to store this renewable energy, just like you do with non-renewable energy on the grid. It's the alternative to that. It's no good just having the energy as and when you need it. It's really important that you generate the energy and then you store it for high peak times. And see, the same applies for even just no matter how you generate it, energy needs to be stored. Like having a cell phone with no battery, that drinks would be crazy. The only time it works is when it's actually on the charger. You wouldn't like that, right? So again, we need the actual storage period. And mega packs are that solution. They are one of the only solutions and the best solution in the market. And the scale that mega packs offer companies, organizations is absolutely essential, especially for companies like, you know, utility companies and large scale energy projects. So I'm really not surprised that Tesla Energy is growing at the rate that it's growing. I'm not surprised that the margins are the best within the whole business. And I do think this is going to continue. There is momentum building. and I'm very excited to see it. So make sure. So yeah, some of the margins are the best uh, that showed on the recent Q3 earnings report, uh, Q3 2024. And not only that, I mean, <laughs> the margins are just there. The business is entirely different. And it's, you know, one of the largest profits that we received even in our generation of earnings overall. So it's a smaller portion of revenue, but it's a larger portion of profit. You're keeping a close eye on Tesla Energy and you're not sleeping on this area. Thank you so much for watching this video. Yeah, yeah. Don't be sleeping. Hey, thanks for watching our video. Fair use and definitely go check it out. Uh, let's see. People are saying they appreciate it. They're amazed. Da, 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 da. Uh, Tesla also gets servicing revenue for as long as the batteries are in use. So that's true, too. So it's a continuing business model. It's a reoccurring. Right. And then they have such lead in energy storage. It should really propel them into the future. That's why I really focus on the energy. And so when we have conversations with people one on one about this, I'm like, let's not talk about the, the, the vehicles. Let's talk about these batteries. Tesla is a remarkably unique company with the combination of EV that vehicles autonomy, robotics, AI, and energy storage. Now, what I would say is what shows in the financial is EVs and AI, or excuse me, and energy. That's hands down boom in the financials. Let's talk about AI. That's a little bit in the financials, right? But autonomy and robotics, a little bit, way less, but energy and EVs, that's definitely right there at the forefront. And let's be honest, a Trump presidency will benefit the Tesla the next four years. So we'll see Tesla grow. If that happens, we don't know. We'll see the American people must vote and whatever happens, happens. And shout out to everybody left, right. I don't care. It's your vote. Vote for the way you want. And net net again, as I said, right, the contracts are there. They were there. Now, when you see the reports on the Q3 2024, you're sitting there shocked and amazed. And I'm not. Because I'm like, bro, we've done the research. We saw the contracts coming. We saw the factories coming online. So America for the win and then Elon for the win. So again, like, share, subscribe. I'll see you guys on the next one. Remember, it's electric, bro. We're catching a future wave. And this is where it's going. Tesla energy storage.